Well, a top focus governor's rule has officially been imposed in Jammu and Kashmir. There's a notification that's been sent out. But uh, most importantly, what's next is the big question because the army has made it clear that Operation All Out will continue like never before. Meanwhile, as governor's rule is kicking in, Omar Abdullah of the National Conference suspects there could be horse trading in the state. He wants early elections. The BJP earlier made it clear sent a hint that they are working on something. Details of what they were working on is unknown, but here's how the story is panning out in Kashmir. And Zinat is joining us live as, uh, as, as the fire, fireworks begin in Jammu and Kashmir over what is next, Zinat. That tweet by Omar Abdullah earlier, earlier this morning, Zinat, hinting at something that the BJP may be working on. Was there a hint? that there could be something before the elections? Up. Absolutely not, uh, Niranjan. This is, uh, state is not in that conditions that the, any party will come to form the government. In fact, yesterday, Umar Abdullah made it very clear that they have not received any mandate in 2014, so they have no reason to form the government. And now at present, when the situation has gone completely out of hand, so joining hands with the PDP or Congress and NC with coming with the PDP is absolutely not possible. So Jammu and Kashmir state is going to witness governor rule for another nine months that is till April when you have the parliament elections here and as far as the sources are telling us that then the general elections will be held that time only right now the focus of governor Anand Vora who's uh, who's at present holding meetings with the home secretary RK Goyal the DGP as Dr. SP Vaid Naveen Chaudhary finance commissioner and all other top slot of Jammu and Kashmir civil as well as the police administration is present at the Raj Bhavan, they are taking, they are focusing on what is important and how to take in care of them to get the peace back on track. Amarnath Yatra is being discussed, the situation on ground is being discussed and also how to provide ease to the commoners on ground. This is the agenda of the NN Vora and also whatever now Vora government will be doing, it will be coming into the account of Delhi government, BJP, because right now at present in JNK, ultimately it is the center that is ruling through NN Vora. Okay, stay with me. Here's how uh, the, the political fight is playing out. Here are the different reactions th that came in on what next in Kashmir. Look, I think that whatever has happened is in the country and in Kashmir. I don't want to say anything about this. The party is slammed. Omar Abdullah has slammed. After that, Congress has also said that the opportunist government was hungry. You were hungry for power. And that's why you've ruined the state of Jammu and Kashmir. मुझे लगता है कि क्योंकि वो अपोजिशन में हैं इसलिए उनको कुछ कहना है लेकिन अगर वो जमीन की हकीकत और सच्चाई को का ईमानदारी के साथ आकलन करेंगे तो उस तरह की चीजें नहीं बोलेंगे आखिर सवाल है सर हाल ही में एक रिपोर्ट आई थी कश्मीर में जहां कहा जाता था कि एट्रोसिटीज है ह्यूमन राइट वायलेशन है हमने पड़ताल करी है उस रिपोर्ट की रिपोर्ट में साफ तरीके से पता चल रहा है कि ये जो पूरा मसला रेज किया गया था इट वॉज Sponsored by Pakistan, it was instigated by Pakistan and Pakistan ISI. So it was a motivated report. Look, there are these kind of motivated reports, these kind of sponsored reports that are coming. We don't need to give any importance to it. We don't need to give any importance to it. We don't need to ignore it. BJP was uh, was uh, uh, aiming for uh, itself under pressure. The people of Jammu and Kashmir have raised the voice against the present government. I mean, the BJP was forced to take this step. Had BJP taken this step uh, in different manner earlier to this uh, problem, the situation would have, you would have given credit to BJP. BJP uh, had no option uh, but to go for governor rule because this bleeding could not have been stopped. Thank God, BJP leadership realized that they were committing a blunder by supporting Mabuba. Well, we told you.